Hello everybody. Now we will see how a goal is scored by the red team. Uh, so let's uh, go step by step how they pass the ball. Uh, the red team starts the game, uh, and their adversary is the yellow team. So let's see step by step. So here we have a 4-4-2 formation by both the teams. The red team is going to start the game. Uh, the ball is in the center. It's uh, denoted by the wh white dot. The referees are in the black uh, circles. Uh, the fourth official, the linesman, and the referee himself or herself. So the red team starts the game. The yellow team pressure puts pressure on the opposition. Then uh, you can see. Then the red team uh, forward chooses to play a long ball t on the left flank towards the left outer. Let's see if the left outer is able to receive the pass. He receives the pass. Now you can see movement along the right flank. The both the the midfielders also coming up, and uh, we will see in the immediate uh, uh, future. Let's see how these people how these players choose to move in which direction so the midfield is up now now the off li off side line chooses to bring themselves up of the red team so the red team is on uh, attack mode now two players of the red team on the left flank they are choosing to go to assist the left outer in keeping position of the ball so that they can rotate the ball so here they are in a triangle position so they can uh, exchange the ball among themselves now they will mount an attack towards the goal with uh, the three forward players let's see how it unfolds so here the center forward and uh, the one of the uh, left or right ends have position of the ball right in front of the goal. Let's see how they choose to play from here on. So the center forward wants to move in space. Uh, he will uh, just move towards his right so that he can receive the ball and mount an attack on the goal. Let's see how it moves. Ball is still in the same place. The player is kept position of the ball. He now the there is heavy movement in both the teams. Let's see how it unfolds. Now there is imminent danger on the left uh, the yellow team's goal. So the yellow team has fallen back. Now left outer of the red team has the ball. The midfield uh, the player chose to play it wide. Now let's see if he is able to cross the ball. He won the he won the ball with the pressure uh, mounting pressure of the f number five of the yellow team. The red team now chooses to cross cross the ball. Now most likely it's an air ball only. So let's see how the centre forward is able to convert this position into a goal or no. So he has to contest the ball in the air with the pressure mounting on him from number three of the yellow team. So number three and number one of the number one of the red team and number three are in the air for the ball. Okay, the red team centre forward won the position, won the ball, and he headed the ball into the ground. The goalkeeper was not able to. Uh, stop the ball and now the, there's a goal scored by the red team. So this is how the goal was scored. The referee confirms the goal and the linesman also confirms the goal and uh, so this is how a, one of a, a goal or uh, in, in the infinite number of possibilities, one possibility of how a goal being scored can be portrayed. So let's go over it once again. 442, pressure, pressure, 
ball to the flank left out of wins the ball players rush towards him for help then they set up a triangle move the ball move towards the goal for pressure center forward try center forward moves into space anticipating the ball player chooses to play it wide wide player sends a cross towards the center center forward wins the ball heads the ball into the ground and the there's a goal scored